Angel. Because I'm the weasel. Did check out the wood you created. Are you down to chow some serious grindage? Go starts are chillin', Major. Totally poly. Uh. <laughs> hey, how you doing? <laughs> Peter Shore here at the bookstore. God, isn't this great? Books. Books, books, books. Books on everything. <laughs> I don't know if uh, you've seen me all week, but uh, my name is Peter Shore, and I am a totally Polish brother. Peter Shore seeking refuge, trying to escape the fact that he's totally Polly's brother, somewhere deep, deep, deep in the totally zone. Sometimes people mistake me for his brother and stuff, and but you know, here I don't think there's going to be a problem because Polly he doesn't know how to read or anything. The best thing he could probably read is maybe a Dr. Seuss, like Green Eggs and Ham or something, or maybe like a menu at a, some sort of little fast food place or something like that. That's about all he could read. But they got great books, like look, like this, The Craft of the Screenwriter. You know, who are they? I'm going to do it just, I'm, I'm writing it like as sort of like a Hitchcock thing, like the rope. There'd be like no edits or stuff like that. Like like a book like that. Look at this, look at this. Terry Gilliam, Baron von Munchausen. He kind of looks like uh, Jose Hebert there, doesn't he? And you know, you wouldn't see Paulie in a place like this because, you know, if he came in here, it'd be like kryptonite to him. I hate books. I hate books. Books, books, knowledge. Ah, it's too much. It's just too much. Just stop it already. I mean, I was in school, you know, and uh, I had a girlfriend, you know, when I was in school, and she broke up with me. Yeah, because I was in slow reading. Because I used to have to wear those headphones, you know, you know, colors, aqua, green, yellow, beep, you know, next, and... Uh, God, this is going to be a good show. We'll be back after these messages, okay, you guys? Ah, oh, God, I, I need some... What is Superman? If he... Kryptonite, how do you fix the... What is it? Ah. Uh, uh, children's section. I like that. Little Polly. <laughs> how long is that going to last? How long is the little... How long is that going to last? It's not going to last very long. You got to read. You got to have some intelligence. You got to have some verbiage going on here. Hop on pop. Green Eggs and Ham, The Cat in the Hat are some of the books. Totally Polly cannot read. Somewhere deep in the Totally Zone. How children fail. Hmm. How did Polly fail? How did he fail? Well, he didn't learn how to read hat. And he couldn't even read that at six years old. It was very hard for him to do that then. I mean, <laughs> I bet he, he couldn't even read that now. <laughs> What's this word? Oh, okay. We... Is that... Is that word? Oh, okay. The? Wait, no, there's an R in there. <laughs> this is hard, man. Dude, have you ever read this? We... Wait, we sat there... We, wait, yeah, okay, there's we again, so I know that at least, because I already said it there. Towu? Towa? What's that? Can you tell me what that one is? Tell me what that one is. This one, what is that? What's that one right there? Oh, okay, two. Oh, okay, two? Oh, God, I'm winded. Oh, man. Okay, we'll be back after these messages, you guys. This it's really, I'm not. Books, books, books. Hey, look at this. This has been like the best day of my life. I mean, I am in a bookstore. There's no one that knows Polly here. There's no one that knows him here. No, 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 not. Peter Shore flipping through the tabloids of the magazine rack. Little does he know, he's about to experience something that is going to shatter his melon. Deep, deep, deep. In the totally so. <laughs> Look at this. I mean, there's just great magazines because, you know, you remember Who Are They, the, this film I'm going to do? I mean, what's going to happen is that's going to become a big, big hit. 
-hmm. And I will be like, look at this magazine. I will be like, like, like this magazine, for instance. This has like the top people, the people that are happening, you know, the now people. I mean, it's like everyone who is happening in show business is in this. And I'm going to be in this. <laughs> and my favorite section is the Star Trek section. Not Star Trek. I'm not a trekker. I'm not a follower. I'm a leader. Anyway, so I'm like, the Star Trek section has like the most happening people in it. And you're looking at that, and then you... In Living Colors, James Carey and Tom Davis is party down with MTV's Polly Shaw. Oh, he's hanging out with Elton John and uh, Don Johnson and Juliet Lewis, isn't it? How did, how did he get to be with those people? They're gonna come to the bookstore and see that. They're gonna come to the bookstore and see that. to get out of this bookstore. You guys drag me out, please. I, I gotta make it to the door. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm never coming to a bookstore again. Help me, drag me out. Come on, come on, you're my buds, right? Uh, get me out. Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Help me, come on, help me. Check out the wood you created. Are you down to chow some serious grinding? Go starts are chillin', mate. Totally poly. Uh. <laughs>